Filtering face piece and half face respirators are covered in other videos linked in the description. Hair follicles may compromise the seal of an elastomeric respirator or filtering face piece, rendering the respirator ineffective. Please refer to the CDC NIOSH Facial Hairstyles and Filtering Face Piece Respirators chart linked in the description for guidance. Let's review how to put on, inspect, fit check, and take off a full face respirator. Depending on the type of full face respirator you are using, the filtering cartridge will attach via a bayonet or threaded attachment system. There are multiple types of filtering cartridges. Make sure you choose the appropriate type for the hazard you are dealing with. If you are unsure what type to use, ask your supervisor or EHS. Next, thoroughly inspect the respirator. There should be no signs of damage or warping. Examine the head harness. It should be elastic without any visible tears, damage, or wear. Look at the inside of the face piece. There should be no warping around the edges where it contacts the face and no visible damage or wear. Check the inhalation valves. They can sometimes be tricky to find, but are always located near where the cartridge is attached to the face piece. You may have to gently move parts of the respirator to see them. They should lay flat on the valve seats. Correct any snagged valves. Next, pop off the exhalation valve cover and examine the exhalation valve. It should lay flat on the valve seat. Correct the valve as necessary and pop the exhalation valve cover back on. Next, put on the respirator by first placing the straps over the front of the face piece and bringing the respirator up to your face. It is often helpful to place your chin in the chin cup first, then bring the rest of the face piece in contact with your face. Hold the respirator to your face while you grab the head harness and pull it over your head. Begin to tighten the straps. Neck straps first, followed by temple straps, and finally the top head strap. The respirator should fit comfortably and tightly against your face. Adjust position as necessary for comfort. Let's now perform a seal check, which is critical to ensure the respirator is fitting you properly and adequately protecting you. Gently place your palms completely over the cartridges. Don't press down. Inhale. You should feel no leaks and the nose cup should collapse in slightly. You can make adjustments as you go if you feel leaks, then check again. Next, gently place your palm completely over the exhalation valve at your chin without pressing hard. Exhale. You should feel no leaks and the respirator should puff up slightly. Tighten the straps and or adjust the nose cup position if you feel leaks and repeat. If you cannot get the respirator to fit without leaking, there may be an invisible problem with your respirator or you may need a different type. In this case, don't proceed with your work until you talk to your supervisor and or EHS. Taking off the respirator is relatively easy. Loosen all of the straps. Once this is done, you can lift the head harness off the back of your head and remove the respirator from your face. Note that you are required to obtain medical clearance, complete specific training, and get fit tested before wearing this type of respirator. If you have any questions regarding respirator usage, please contact Harvard University's Environmental Health and Safety Office. Thank you.